This is Rundown Radio. Beyonce this, Beyonce that. Angie, you gonna pull up on that world tour she got with Jay? I love, okay, I'm not a part of the Beehive, but I do love J and B. My thing is, Jay-Z alone is worth 900, estimated $900 million. Mm -hmm. Beyonce, right there with him, right? What's better than one billionaire? Two. Real life. Why the fuck would you charge $400 for nosebleed seats? You need to be doing free fucking festival shows at the local park of these neighborhoods and leave us the fuck alone. We didn't gave you your fortune. Angie. You ain't doing me no favors. Wait, what? And I'm not Angie. I'm not using all no, I'm not done. I'm not using all my money to see you do the same fucking choreography that I've seen you do the last three times I saw your ass. It's simple. There's only one answer. They can. Not only can no not only can they, but they, they could for a while. They've always been doing Are the twins thing. coming out? Angie, Are we watching them take their first steps? Angie, they trying to get to a billion dollars. Yes, sir. They're already there. No. Together, together, they're already. Hey. Individually. Hey. Listen to me. You know, they probably feel in their gas tank halfway. I want to know how many kids stole their parents' credit cards to book those fucking tickets. Because no one in their right mind is going, to, unless you have a connect. Do you know how hungry Jay-Z is for that billion dollars? Let me tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to watch the shit on Instagram live because someone's going to go live. One of the blogs are going to post <laughs> it. By the time LA date comes, I would have seen the whole fucking show. I don't even need to go. From the comfort of my own app and my phone, they can suck all the dicks I don't have. (laughs) I didn't like 444. And the one she had. I didn't like Lemonade. That's interesting. They're going to drop a joint album before Coachella. It's going to send everyone in a fucking frenzy. And I still ain't buying no goddamn tickets. Damn, I, the beehive. I could hear the beehive coming right now. <laughs> like a sting me. Sting the fuck out of me. Hey, if you're okay? 30, if you're 30 and up and then the beehive, kill yourself. Damn. Kim Kardashian has became so successful of milking her fans. You know, if Kim Kardashian gonna do it and you're Beyonce, you're like, yo, look, I didn't gave these fans 20 years of my best. So I can do what I want price wise. Kim Kardashian just do it and her sisters do it faithfully for no fucking reason at all with zero talent. Right. So if you got people like that taking that kind of money off zero talent, I'm, I'm do just it too. saying make the price reasonable. Make the prices reasonable. Like, you know your fan base. They got a sale on Darion. Stop. <laughs> I'm so mad that she even had that brand. She tried. I do love Ivy Park though. She tried. Ivy Park is really cute. She's like, get some Darion with these tickets. <laughs> Hey, listen, man. Your Beyond- fucking ticket prices is too high, girl. We trying to go, but you ain't letting me be great. She trying to get her man to a she billion dollars. She is already there, man. No, they there together, but it means so much more when that man become a billionaire for hip hop. Before Puff, before Dre, before everybody. I'm focused, man. It's a real race. They, they. I'm telling you, they say they still shopping at Costco. I have a question. They saving every dollar to Would get to Beyonce that billion. Would Beyonce be who Beyonce is if it wasn't for Jay? And vice versa. No. Yes. Today? Mm-hmm. No. Jay-Z would have been a legend, but he's become a universal like monument. Yes, because of I think Beyonce. they would have th- Yes. They separately, would. individually. Okay. Would they be the who they same are? success? No, no way. That's my answer. But yes. I respect your answer, Angie. Yeah, I respect yours too, but I I think they would. Now, is Oprah bigger than Beyonce? Yes. Yes. In a sense of what? She can be the president if she really put her mind to it and fucking ran a campaign. Not even if she put her mind to it. If she just said, yeah, I want to be president. But like sh- legit, like if Beyonce right. ran for president, be like, oh, um, God, here we go. Beyonce, I don't really know if you can handle policy. And <laughs> with Oprah, you kind of, you know, she's got a more she journalistic interview. Brain. Now to deflect that, because I'm on the other side. That Beyonce is bigger than Oprah? We talking hypothetical. Okay. Y'all looking at me like y'all got the O tattered on your chest. I mean, she's our superwoman. Oprah is more popular than Beyonce. She is. I don't believe that. There's no... She's Oprah Winfrey. Winfrey. Before Beyonce, there was Oprah. After Beyonce, hopefully Oprah there will still be around. There won't be no after Beyonce, Angie. <laughs> You're such an ass. There won't be no after Beyonce. But Oprah's like the first, you know, she's legend. She's Anything she says is golden and you, you feel inspired to just... 
I'm gonna have violins playing. In the Oprah background. is the meaning of life. Oprah is a wrinkle in time. Exactly. <laughs> She ain't even got a wrinkle on her face. Money long. Hey. Money is super long. And she's so humbled and grounded. And right. like, she doesn't have to do the extras. You know what I'm saying? Like, she is who she is. No, no. But here's the crazy thing. As we talk about Oprah, Oprah is a little crazy too. And she's about her business. And that being those fucking conferences that she has, those fucking tickets, it's like $2,500. Mm. All right. Well, look, I ain't mad at Oprah. But look, I'm going to say this. If Oprah had a dick, I'm going to need y'all to get off of it. <laughs> you know, because... She don't even need to have a dick. I'm going to still be on it. Um, Yeah. Oprah has a lifelong career body of work. That's She's older than Beyonce. So off top, her history is longer with right. the world. You know, she has her school in Africa. She has her network that she owns. No pun. Does Oprah mean more than Beyonce? Yes. But Angie, out of eight billion people if on this earth, if we went to hundred people right now and surveyed and just went, no, no, and said all Beyonce the people would know Oprah. both. But I'm saying if you go to India and do that, or if you go to Singapore and do that, or if you go to who Malaysia, who doesn't know Oprah Winfrey though? Keyword popular. I'm not saying who's the better person, y'all. I'm, I'm not saying who's the one you we want to mold our kids after. I'm saying out of eight billion people, whatever the amount of people living on this planet Earth, how many of them know? The other more between Oprah and Beyonce. I feel like you would have to be a fucking idiot if you don't know who Oprah is. There's a lot of idiots. No, there isn't. <laughs> there's, there's a I lot still of think people. Oprah's more well known. She's been on the earth longer. Right. Just that alone makes it more people know her. People live in huts and they doing the single ladies dance. So they heard the name and they just picked up on this dance. The music, the music translated. So because Oprah doesn't write songs, no one knows who she hey, is on the other side of the world? Hey, Wrinkle in Time, ain't, it, ain't, it ain't reached far enough. It just Whatever. came out. Everybody who's seen Wrinkle in Time knew who Oprah was. Did you see it? No, but I still know who Oprah is. <laughs> I'm, I'm not saying I'm not going to see it because I heard it was good. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to see it. When? Mm -hmm. But I, I didn't come with the same energy like everybody did Black Panther, though. God damn, God damn. All right, ladies, we're going to take some calls and we're going to ask a few people what they think. So let's get right into it. Who you rocking with? I don't think about him to be honest, but if somebody was to name, if you were to be like, yo, you need to pick a wealthy black female. You know what I'm saying? A known wealthy black female. It would probably be Oprah. So it would probably be Oprah. Be no, we want to know who's more popular, though, not more wealthy. We want to know. Oh, Oprah. Oh, Oprah's more Oprah. popular than Beyonce? Okay. Yeah. Because you got to think, all right, Beyonce is just the music industry. Yeah, she's done a few movies, but Oprah is like a spokeswoman for all African American women. All right, look, I can't knock it, man. I can't knock it. The man has spoken. Straight out of Michigan, easy, he has bro. spoken. Take, take it easy, brother. We got a caller from New York. Who you rocking with, Oprah or Beyonce? Nah, Oprah is out. It's all about Beyonce nowadays with the new generation. All right, I fuck with it, man. You think more people know who Beyonce is more than Oprah in this world? Probably, yeah. Why would you say that? Just because, I mean, Oprah was cool back in the day, I guess, maybe like a couple decades ago, last decade. But, I mean, Beyonce really blew up, and she's just out. She outworked Oprah to be more popular is what you're saying? Yeah, pretty much. All right. Run down radio. All right, we got a caller from Michigan. Who you rocking with, Oprah or Beyonce? I'm Queen B all the way. All right. No, look, I fuck with Beyonce, too. I'm over here uh, saying Beyonce more known. You know, I feel like more people on this earth know who the fuck she is. Oh, man. yeah. Like, even, like, global-wise, bro. Like, her music is, like, I don't know, bro. I feel like that shit is everywhere. Hell you feel yeah. me? But then Oprah, Oprah, you know, Oprah has always been here type shit. So it's like, I don't know. It's Beyonce, bro. Beyonce, bro. You look like a dirty ass dude. You look like you eat both their asses. <laughs> <laughs> you look like you quick to eat Oprah's ass. <laughs> that little beard you got. <laughs> anyway, um, Beyonce, I feel like her stadium fit more people than mm -mm. Oprah's. Mm -mm. If there's 8 billion people, I feel like just a handful more know who Beyonce is. I 
believe, in my opinion, that Oprah is bigger than Beyonce. I just, I, I just do. I, you I'm know, not knocking she gives that. a speech at the fucking award show, and everyone's inspired to be better the next day. Angie, Beyonce who? gives a speech for the Grammys, and she fucking. I just want to thank everybody. Thank you. <laughs> well, listen, if, <laughs> if I had to... my husband, I want to thank Blue. If I <laughs> if I had the decision to have my daughter hang out with only one person tomorrow between Oprah and Beyonce, it's going to be Oprah. Of course. But is Oprah the more popular person to this world? Yes. Than Beyonce? Yes. Oprah's Y'all a god. Y'all say yes. I just told you. Look, it's the preference thing again. It's some not people, a preference. Some it's people like preference. Denzel more than Will, but they can't but Beyonce, say. But Beyonce, but But they cannot say, say that, that Denzel did better than Will. Is what, and that's all I'm saying. I'm just saying. Will Smith is more popular than Denzel Washington. I know, but there's Denzel fans that are saying, but, they, but he ain't better than Denzel. But I'm not saying he better than Denzel. I'm saying he more popular And that's than what we're Denzel. saying. Oh, God. Yeah, okay. Well, let's go ahead and just take this call. We got, hold on. We got Amber Rose on the line. I just want to say hi, guys. Hey, Amber. Amber, what up? Hey. hey. So, you know, I love Beyonce. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh. Beyonce is like the fucking queen. Let him know, Amber. I don't know, guys. <laughs> I just... Did you see my new boobies? You got any back pain? Oh, shit. Not anymore. <laughs> Isn't titties big as fuck, girl? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> she got them reduced. <laughs> oh, hey, hey. <laughs> hey, I just want to know. I can't. Is there any hoes at the slut walk? Oh. <sighs> fucking rude why would you ask her that it's a movement show about that or is it like a place for men to go and get some house don't make me disconnect on you <laughs> because right. i will i am i'm fucking with you we're sorry we're well, sorry real quick real quick which is bigger your head or one of your titties <laughs> <laughs> I she wanted... has them reduced. Don't hey, answer I'm that, Amber. I'm talking about natural titties. Don't answer <laughs> What's that. What's bigger, your titty or your head? I hate you. <laughs> Plead the fifth. Probably my right titty. <laughs> mm. So when you come down to us, you're fucking pervert. You need to stop. All right. You are all right, such a Amber. pervert. Okay, all right, listen. I'm sorry, Just, Amber. Yeah. Thank you for calling in. And Thanks, Amber. Amber. Thank Bye, you. Amber. Be on the lookout for my new project that's oh. not known yet because I don't even know it. <laughs> oh. hey, but you had a single though. I did. And I you, think. And you got Wiz. <laughs> I do. Well, Twenty One Savage. Thank you. You should get back like with Wiz though. Person, but you got Wiz friend. for like what? They're like just both skinny with big dicks. Oh. Yeah, but you got Wiz for like ten plus though. All right. That's well. the difference. All right, Amber. I appreciate you calling. Thank you. All right, guys. Thanks. Bye. Bye. All right. So even Amber Rose thinks Beyonce is hotter than Oprah. Are you sold now, Angie, or what? She's Oprah Winfrey. Like, I just feel like, and Beyonce's Beyonce. I mean, you know, they both can go Oprah, Beyonce, one name, but I just think. We're coming at this real American right now, y'all. In America, Oprah's the shit. But there are a lot of people who don't know that name. In this world. There's Muslims out there. Who there's people Oprah in Russia is. who don't know who Oprah is. There's people in Singapore who don't know who I'll Oprah tell you is. where nobody knows but who either of them is are. Everywhere. North music. Korea. Music is they don't everywhere. Care. North Korea don't know Beyonce or Oprah. No, okay. they, but, but, hey, but the music translate. They ain't heard it. They don't got no extras. That shit got a beat to it and some ass shaking. Okay. And that is definitely That's a universal language. No, it's oh, here. <laughs> just like a fucking guy. What you mean? Ass shaking is a universal language. Wait, what do you mean? I'm saying it's facts. Major killer. It's not a universal language. You ain't even got to say a word and I'm glued to that shit and I could just be fresh out the cave. Okay. <laughs> so what the f- So you're saying. Come straight out that cave. Be like, oh, some ass. <laughs> What? And music? What? What does that have That's to do? My, that is my language. <sighs> Sometimes. I could be speaking Guyanese in this motherfucker. Oh, here we go. Don't start. I right. But once that music come on and that ass shake, I'm speaking that. Okay. I'm fluent. That's really good. But Oprah is still more popular. <laughs> I'm shaking fluent. Your ass. That Beyonce ringing a little bit more. So, Just a might. little bit. She very well might. Because she's a performer. 
and an entertainer. And a professional ass shake. But I still, I mean, yeah. I, that's I don't want to see it, Oprah's that, ass. I didn't want to see Oprah's ass 30 years ago. That might be giving her too Oprah's much credit. Oprah's feet, though. <laughs> <laughs> e. Well, Beyonce's ain't too much better. Have you ever zoomed in on a picture? She's got... Mm. She, she got some cool feet. <laughs> Oprah has a bunion, bruh. <laughs> Like the whole maybe it was just a bad week. Maybe Beyonce's her doctor second, was no. Second that shit toe. is like a, you know, like a broken bone on the side. It's from wearing all them, squeezing in all them heels on her show for thirty plus years. You think Beyonce's toes look any better? Hey, look, Beyonce didn't put in some work on them feet, y'all. Second toe looks like this. Yeah, she does all her work on her feet in it, high heels at a high level every time like for a, hours on stage. But but is it not boss like? Half more than half a year. Sounds like you coming with the money facts. Oprah's more popular. Hey, pop, let's, yeah, let's let's stay on that popularity thing. Who's better, Oprah? Who's more popular, Oprah? Beyonce. Oprah. Solange. The fuck? What is wrong with that? I do I do love a seat at the table. Matthew. Michelle Williams. <laughs> oh, Michelle! Congrats on the engagement. Farrah Franklin. <laughs> That's not. She doesn't even count. She Not was original. in there for like five. She was in Destiny's Child as long as I was in Destiny's Child. <laughs> Never. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> so, look, all right. So, I'm, I appreciate y'all. I'm glad that we all came. Can we agree agreed, that yeah, agree Oprah for is once. shit? For once. Yeah, for once. This is the only that, time that we'll Beyonce agree. Beyonce is hands down. You want to get punched in your face right now. Not as popular as Oprah. <laughs> Thank the you. The end. More popular than Oprah Winfrey, the big up, the big up. Did nobody say that? No, no one's. Ain't nobody watch your own. Damn. The fuck? You watch Iyama fix my life? Ain't nobody watching that. I do. I watch it. Bullshit. I watch. People uh, love Greenleaf. <laughs> Greenleaf, and then yeah. there's. Uh, I just wanted to sound like a hater. Yeah, because you, you are. <laughs> yeah. Oprah, hire me. Yes. <laughs> Yeah. Blackball his ass like uh, <laughs> they did Monique. Or, oh, damn. Or blue ball my ass. What? It's the rundown, y'all. <sighs> the big O. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Hey, I love y'all. Thank y'all very much <laughs> for y'all hate and support.